On the 20th anniversary of the Pay Equity Act in Ontario, the Canadian Auto Workers Union joined with 38 other unions and organizations to demand that the provincial government live up to its responsibilities to women. Women are still at 71 cents on the male dollar and uh, the government has failed to fund its pay equity obligations and uh, so we're asking for uh, the government to honour its obligations and also to look at the maintenance of pay equity going forward. At a press conference at Queen's Park, Equal Pay Coalition Executive Director Mary Cornish stressed the need for immediate action by the Ontario government. The increasing the minimum wage um, to $10 an hour and that is retroactive to January 1st, 2008. Because this is a pay equity down payment, it can't wait until 2010. And also, because it is part of what we see as a key poverty reduction strategy measure, it has to happen now as well. The second issue is the full public funding of the um, uh, public uh, sector pay equity adjustments. Outside the legislative building, only the NDP showed up to speak to the demonstrators. Sherry DeNovo, Parkdale High Park NDP MPP, endorsed the demand for prompt government action. The face of poverty in this province is a woman's face. It's also a child's face. One in six of our children live in poverty, and that's because women live in poverty. Where there's a poor child, there's a poor mother, and that's a shame. Figures show that in 2006 and 2007, the government has fallen behind in paying its commitment to pay equity for public sector employees by $369 million. And between 2009 and 2011, the figure will top $1.32 billion. McDonald says the government can afford to meet its obligations. Phyllis Foster, CAW Women's Advocate for CAW Local 1285, says the government can't ignore the issue and not feel the impact at the polls. They need to start listening and doing something. We're 52% 50 of the population is women in Canada and they're not listening. They have to do something for us. Women have to start standing together looking um, at our rights and what the governments are doing for us today. Throughout 2008, the coalition intends to mark the 20th anniversary with events drawing public attention to the fact that women in Ontario are still paid on average 29% less than men. For women workers of colour, the gap is 36% and for Aboriginal women, the gap is 54% less than males. The CAW is encouraging members to contact their MPPs and tell them exactly what they think of this ongoing economic discrimination. CAW. Fighting back makes a difference.